it's Weepsy and we're back today with the last episode of Hogwarts Legacy. We are finishing the main story today, at least I think we are. And for the occasion, of course, I do as I always do. I am cosplaying my character. Usually I do a cosplay or a special makeup but I decided to cosplay my character and have a little bit of fun. So we did the um, scar that I have on the side of my face on my character and we have of course the wig because I don't have pink hair and I already had those Gryffindor accessories of course and my wand. So I'm a proper witch now. Wingardium Leviosa. I I feel like the wig is so extra, it's so funny, it's like really really um, fluffy around here and I, I don't know, it's really extra, I know it's not exactly like my character because it's difficult to find a wig that is not expensive and looks like my characters, but honestly I still dig it, I think this cosplay is really fun and it was really fun to make and you know it's always fun to pretend a little bit and that's what games are. You lose yourself in the universe and I just like to cosplay when I finish a game as, you know, a thank you kind of to the people who worked on the game. But yeah, just to show my appreciation basically and this game really, really deserves the appreciation. Like I enjoyed my time so much playing this. I am not ready for it to end. Well, I'm not really done. I have so many side quests still that I can do after I finish the main story, but you know, still. The playthrough was amazing on the channel and I thank you guys so much for that. But without further ado, let's jump into it. All right, let's go. Uh, we are going to the map chamber. Let me see. We have final repository. Defend Hogwarts from Renrock. Um, it was like very pressing matters. But then we went and did exploring and side quests. <laughs> it's always like that. It's gonna be like, we have no time. Let's go. And then I'll be like, yeah, I've been exploring for days on end. Sorry. I just find it really funny. And every time we go to the map chamber, the portraits are like, we have no time to talk. I don't know. It's always like that. Anyways, let's see. Victor Rookwood is dead. He confronted me as I left Ollivander's with the Keeper's wand. I had to defend myself. Godric's heart. Yep. Are you all right? I know you're well able to defend yourself. Mm -hmm. I've seen it often enough, but Rookwood himself. He would have killed me once he found the repository, if not before. I yeah, had he was no like, Avada Kedavra right. this, Avada Kedavra that. You had that. no choice. It was crazy. You did what you had to do. With Harlow in custody and Rookwood gone, the wizarding community owes you a great debt. Thank you for saying so, Professor. Right. I'm ready for what's next. All right, Are we, then. though? The Keepers have been waiting. <sighs> Are we ready? I should... I should, uh... Put you something on my have completed all of our trials, that looks more like and you what have I'm done wearing. so under circumstances even <laughs> I did not foresee. You understand now why all of this was necessary. The port key, the vault, the locket, the book, the trials. To ensure that one with the ability you and I share would make the same choice that San, Neve, Charles, and I did. Now that Ooh, you have witnessed have my memory, you understand all that is at stake. Not everyone is what they seem. As you know, light does not exist without shadow, right. nor shadow without light. Yeah. Simply because you can eliminate darkness yeah. she does said not that before, always right? mean that you should. Yeah. Even the most well-meaning and competent amongst us cannot possibly know the consequences of manipulating what should be beyond our reach. What lies in the repository must never be released. Resist the temptation to destroy or control it. The magic that you have so carefully honed must now be used only to 
protect the Why secret can't we, destroy we it, though? keep. You have the That's wand. Weird. You will know when to wield it. We leave our legacy in your hands. I thought it was gonna be a huge pensive. <laughs> that would have been crazy. Must be the way to the repository. Oh boy. That. Okay, that's very cool. Magic. I forgot to. I. I. Oh no! I showed you guys. I showed you guys right in the intro. My wand. Doesn't look like it, it has a nice weight to it too. And that we find nothing but a repository undisturbed Magic. beyond this door. Yes. I know. And I didn't show my I have a tie. And I have a little scarf. I'm pretty proud of all my accessories that I have. I want more though. I wish I had like more official. This one is official from um mm, I don't know if this one is from Orlando, I'm not sure. But, um, yeah, uh, this one, this one is Amazon, you know, like it's not, and that as well, it's not like the real that deal. I the enchantments protecting the castle would protect against an incursion I guess it doesn't from matter. below. I fear they may not. Although, if they don't now, I can assure you, they will in the future. Were you able to reach Professor Weasley? I was. Hopefully she and the others will arrive soon. They know where to find the door through which we entered. <gasps> Wait, before I forget. Um. Let me see what we can do. <laughs> hmm. More like this, right? I wish I had that scarf. I think that scarf is really cute. Uh, is there another one better? Like this? <laughs> we need to look alike a little bit, right? Oh, I like this one, yeah. I think this one is the best. Okay. Now, we look more similar, let's see. We're not the same, but we're more similar. <gasps> no way we're at the same time. Let's go. No, oh, good lord. No way that we just arrived at the same time. If his loyalists are here, he cannot be far behind. You and I have faced worse, Professor. There's the area. Must be here somewhere. We must be getting closer. Renrook will be pleased with our progress. No oh, quiet shit. Enough. <laughs> okay. We need to press on. Ranwell oh. must be here. Somewhere. Okay. <laughs> I was like, this he's just saying between us and him. We need to move it. Now I shall handle it. One moment. Oh, good Let's lord, go. that's a dip also. A huge dip also. Okay. Oh, nice. Oh, lord. I see it. And I don't know. You will not take what is not yours. Let me Okay. 
it's about to. There we go. Give me that. <laughs> There's too many. All right. Why am I not touching it? Huh? I can't? Huh? Oh, that was weird. That was a weird glitch. I was about to! Huh? Maybe I can petrificus to tell this? Oh, I can't. Oh, that's weird. Did they patch that or something? Because... Or maybe there's like a cutscene after. So... I don't know. Because usually I would be able to attack them still. This one's almost down. Why is he just going after... Uh, Oh my god, are you okay, Professor? No match for us. That was weird. A dead end. Now what? Huh. Strange. Rebellion. There's here. Professor! That wall! That's the way forward. It worked! Let's go. Oh, I'm full. Lumos. The music. Ramrock must be getting closer to finding the repository. I fear you're right, Professor. There's nothing we can do but keep searching. Lumos. Listen, more goblins up ahead. Uh huh. Why? It's the How nice of you. Don't buy. Ah. Ah. The music is so epic. Ow. These tunnels haven't brought us much luck so far. Lord. Oh, what is this? Okay. Um. Did I did I sell before? Okay, we're fine. I was scared, but we're fine. Oh, okay. Um, like this? I don't know. Revelia. I see my... Oh, okay. We're getting closer, Professor. That way. But can't we go here, though? Or up there? No? I guess not. Oh, Lord. Phoenix in the Ministry. Ministry of, ma of Magic, I mean. It feels the, the same. Someone's gonna die. Defensive charts. Oh, this is wrong. Someone's 
someone's gonna die, I don't feel good. It feels like... Like they when Sirius this. died, you know? Professor Shard, please. No. Oh, Lord. <gasps> oh. This is easy. You're amazing. The force is strong with this one. <laughs> Oh wow, as a bridge too. Damn. Oh, that's convenient. Oh, God damn. <laughs> Professor Fig running is so cute. He's like, oh, oh. I don't know. Ooh, can I have those two boss fights? I would love it. Yep. Uh huh. Or a different lead. The one! Quickly! Really? I'm ready. They said you'll know when to use it, but it's Professor Fig that told me. Lay your arms, please. Ooh, beautiful! Lay out your arms. Oh yeah, that's it. We made it. I'm relieved we got here before Ranrock. Maybe we should um I can't believe this is it. Well what do the we do now? We can't destroy it this castle for hundreds of years. Think of all the pain that created it. This is what Miriam, George, your friend Lodgok, and countless others died for. Miriam believed this forgotten magic could be used for such good. But she did not know the risks. She did not see what the Keepers have shown you. What Isadora showed you. 
You are now the keeper of whatever power it holds. What do you intend to do with it? I plan to keep the repository as it is. I'm pleased to hear that. I've been thinking. What is it, Professor? I spent all year trying to keep our journey a secret from everyone, including Professor Weasley. But now I wonder if I should have shared it with her. I was afraid you would turn others. against Sooner. us for a Trust second there. No the Keepers wanted this secret to be locked away forever. How long will you keep it? Oh, it would have been crazy. Well, it's not too late, I guess. But it could have been like, ha ha ha, and being the villain all along or something. Ha ha ha. <laughs> so stupid. I plan to keep it a secret for now. But in time, when I'm ready, I plan to tell those I trust everything and accept their help. I believe that is what Miriam would have wanted. We should trust in others. If anyone can rise to this challenge, my friend, it is you. What? God. Ah. The arrogance of wizard kind. Ah, we need to get rid of him. Goblins built this repository. It belongs to us. Enough, Ranrock. It was never yours. I've been wanting to play with this. Oh, he has a wand now? Miriam's wand. What? If she'd simply handed over the container. All of this could have been avoided. Foolish, self-important witch. <coughs> Seems you were two of a kind. She didn't know when to give up either. Oh my god. Oh, what the fuck? at all times that's really annoying ay, ay, ay. I can't lock on it's so annoying okay, that's... Yeah. now I can't Yeah. 
just fall. How long are you going to keep up the strength? I I can I can run. Okay. Here? Alright. This is crazy. Uh, ooh, a nice boss arena. You can't run forever. What was that slide no though? Now, oh, 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 oh. Wait, I'm dead? Wait, really? That 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 uh one shot me? Ah oh, fuck, I'm sorry for dying guys. I really thought we could do it first try, but I guess not. I keep trying to to lock on, but you can't lock on if he uh, like gets the the armor, not armor off, but I don't know how to call it any other way. Um, oh come on! Ooh. Yeah, no. I did. What do you mean? There we go. I'm so sorry. I'm in peace. Annoyed. <laughs> like no I couldn't do anything hmm I don't like this boss fight I gotta say it's not that it's uh, difficult in it is difficult but not in a good sense it's like uh, because of the um, uh, the lock on it's, it's shit you know what I mean that's why like that's not that's not very nice Like, that's so annoying. Okay. Like, what's this gonna be? Okay. Oh, wow, wow, wow. I was looking at my health. I was not looking. <laughs> 
going on like i get it but i what <laughs> i did like a new repository <laughs> miriam what oh yeah Why? What the fuck happened? Why? From old age? What is that? What? What the fuck? Why? Huh? Why did he... No, he's not dead. No, I think he just... He's just tired. Like, like, that doesn't make any sense. Like, why? <laughs> okay. Just because I, I made a new <coughs> repository? <laughs> professor Eleazar Fig. I dare say he was He's a dead. beloved professor to many of you. Huh? Suddenly a long standing okay, that's ridiculous. colleague to his peers. What the a fuck? A famed adventurer and seeker <laughs> of knowledge. He built a reputation. <laughs> okay, sure. Charging into the you died from a white light. You saw the white light. <laughs> discretion and safety. Providing perhaps a rather unfortunate lesson for us all. His devotion to adventure was rivaled I, I'm only shocked. by his dedication to Hogwarts. And of course, to his wife, Mary, uh, oh. Midi, um, whom we lost much too soon as well. Um, <clears throat> <laughs> Professor Fig, 
represented the best of all of us. Oh, he could be deviously clever, possessed a brilliantly inquisitive mind, and was the most loyal of friends. There's nobody in the Great Hall. What but is going on? It was his <laughs> remarkable courage, for which we will all be forever indebted to him. If not for Professor Fig. Well, I can say with confidence that if not for him, many of us, let alone Hogwarts, would not be here today. Those that knew him best will agree that we must now honor him as only Hogwarts can, by wisely, resourcefully, justly, and bravely facing all that lies ahead. <clears throat> to Professor Fig! Like, that's super nice and all, but, like, I don't... Why did he die, though? Like, I don't get it. <laughs> like, he had a heart attack? Like, what happened? <laughs> I'm sorry, but, like, what the hell Can't is going on? Fig. Hi, Sebastian. I didn't know him as well as you did, but I know he was a good I, man. I can't believe it either. Brad Weasley believe spoke me. for him. She honored him well. Fig will be well remembered. I... Wish the same could have been done for my uncle. I wonder if there's a chance Anne would meet me. No, I read the letter. I can't imagine what you and Anne are going through. Perhaps you'll hear from her soon. I hope so. I... I'll let you know. Sebastian, there's something you should know. It's to do with Victor Rookwood. I heard a rumor that he confronted you outside of Ollivander's. Sounds as if he faced quite a fight. The rumors are true, and I did. But it's not that. Just before Rookwood attacked, he uttered something familiar. The same words Anne heard before she was cursed. Oh, yeah! Children should be seen and not heard. Yeah! Wait, what? So what he's are you the one who it cursed wasn't her. One of Ranrock's loyalists yeah, who yeah, yeah. Anne. It was Rookwood. Yeah. It was Rookwood Makes all sense. along. This. this can't be. It was the You loyalists. hated goblins for nothing. It's always been them. You stupid. The night Anne was <laughs> cursed, all she saw were goblins. Once Rookwood allied with Ranrock, Isadora's estate became of interest to them both. That's why Rookwood was there the night Anne was cursed. Yeah, makes sense. He was working with Ranrock. When he saw your sister, well, he didn't want anyone to know. So he cursed her, and she's never been the same. He's dead, though. So cruel. Yeah. Rookwood deserved what he got. Thank you for telling me. It wasn't a goblin. I suppose I owe you an apology. You owe every goblin an apology. You owe the, the enemy, goblin you killed. But it was never that by simple. By his own end, an apology. Ominous said he's spoken with Anne. I wonder if she'll see me. I'll find out and send word when I know more. I'm still not satisfied with that quest line, dude. Oh, it's spring. I'm. <sighs> I mean, he seemed okay, but like, are you gonna continue on your dark path, or are you good? Like, are you regretting killing your uncle? Or... Hmm. Oh, what the fuck was that? Congratulations, you have completed the story of Hogwarts Legacy. Reached the end of your school year with your OWLs exams fast approaching. Now is a good time to review your field guide, progress, explore the world, finish any remaining relationship storyline, and side quests. Complete your field guide as you see fit. Damn. I'm... Dude. I'm mad. You know why? I really like Professor Fig. But the way they, they, they got rid of him, the way they killed him off... Is so bad... That I didn't feel anything. I'm mad about that. Thoughts about what you told me in the Great Hall. I would like to speak with you. Meet me in the Undercroft as soon yes. as you can. Like the 
uh, I'm really let down by all the that we did today. <laughs> like, don't don't get me wrong. I still love the game. Obviously, it doesn't change anything. It's just first of all, the boss fight was bleh, and then the music was really good, and the scene where all the teachers are there is really cool. Uh, but that's it, right? Like, I'm... Uh, like, Professor Fig dying like that? What the hell? It's it's kind of good, though, because he can see... Um... Rebellion. Miriam, again? I mean, whatever you believe in. But, like, joining her, whatever. But it's, it's just... Damn, it's the way that they did it, though. Like, for real? I'm really let down by that. And then... I'm trying to find the secret uh, room that you guys were talking about, by the way. If you were wondering what I was doing right now. Um... And then this speech was super nice, but like... I couldn't feel... A d I'm... I'm... Dude, I'm mad right now. Not mad, but like I'm disappointed, I think. I think that's the word. It's just... Eh? Okay. I don't know. Oh. A little more. Back. It's like it happened too fast and like with no reason at all. And then they're trying to make me feel something with that with that speech. It ain't gonna work. Like what what I don't know. It's just strange. It's just strange. That's it. Bevelio. You look weird. But I don't know if Incendio. <laughs> if I can do anything about that. <laughs> I don't think so. Bevelio. Alohomora. I'm sorry, you guys, for my lack of um, <laughs> empathy in the moment. Like, it's not lack of empathy. It's just it's not well executed, in my opinion. That like that that was mm. disappointing. And then there was nobody in a great hall. It was like a super big speech. There's a professor who died. Rebellion. And like. No, we, we we good. We good, we... <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Anyways. Just making sure I'm not missing anything. That chest I opened. I'm um I don't know guys what I what I'm missing. Uh, you guys said that there was like a secret room or something in in this Pavelio. I can't say I ever thought Ramrock stood much of a chance. <gasps> it's just a lot of bluster and noise. Oh well, yes. Okay, I found it. Alohomora. I was like, oh, that looks like the Undercroft. And then, you know. There we go. Thank you for telling me, guys, that I was missing something. Revelia. I don't think I've been here. That's so cute. Uh, sorry. Confringo. I thought maybe. But nah. That that's it. There's nothing else. Huh? Okay. I thought there would be more, like a field page, or something. But nah. <sighs> I love this game though. I, I do. Up with clever passwords day in, day out. 
Not as easy as it looked. <laughs> sure. Now we look more similar. When she's in the light a little bit more, then then her hair looks like pink, you know? Then then we're more similar. Right? Because like this, it's more like light pink. Damn, I did the... Uh, this car pretty good, eh? That's not bad at all. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> In the shadow of friendship. And we have talked to Professor Weezy. All right. Yeah, let's talk to Sebastian. I am very curious what he has to say. Um, that quest line, though. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm I hope I hope you guys understand. Like, I'm sad for Professor Fig. I don't want to seem like completely cold and horridly. <laughs> you guys saw me cry multiple times in this play too, so I know you you don't think that, but um. But it's just the way that... Yeah, and I mean, I think I explained myself enough. I will shut up now. <laughs> I don't know why I'm talking. Let's talk I'm to Sebastian. <laughs> Sebastian, I received your L. Okay. What's happened? Ominous spoke with Anne about what happened with my Uncle Solomon. She believes I should pay for what I did, but she won't turn me in. She said the guilt I'll have to live with is punishment enough. I'm so sorry. But I'm glad to know that you can at least try to move on now. The thing is, I think I've lost my sister, mm -hmm. my twin, forever. She refuses forever, to even but... see me. I can't blame her. I couldn't really blame any of you if you gave up on me entirely. You all believed in me, and I let you all down. Anne may just need some time. Surely one day she'll be able to forgive you. I hope you're right. I realize I can't undo what's been done, but I can try every day to make up for it. I owe you an ominous everything for standing by me. Well, it wasn't easy. But I believe in you, Sebastian. I've had a sense about you since that first day in Defense Against the Dark Arts. Seems so long ago. Thank you. I have no idea what's to come, but I'm grateful for your friendship. I'm glad you came to Hogwarts. You know, that's not... That's not a sallow grave. You know, that's not that bad. I don't hate that. Rebellion. It's not the best. I I still think we forgive him way too fast and... But he doesn't seem like he's gonna continue on, on whatever he was doing to try to save Anne. He doesn't... He seems to be, like, regretting. You know, it's... Not the worst. I wondered if you might teach me how to cast a curse that you mentioned. Oh. oh which one? Nah. <laughs> On second thought, perhaps I don't need to learn any curses at the moment. Very well. Let's speak again soon. Interesting that you can still learn it, though. <laughs> After everything. <laughs> oh, Lord. But he, it's, it, like, I think any of the choices I would have made, I wouldn't have been happy with. Like, that's how it is with this. But this is not too bad. Maybe I'm just, I'm just in denial. I don't know. <laughs> but, like, I feel like it's not too bad. Mm. Oh. History of magic. Yeah. Attend history of magic class. I, I will surely do. I never go to that part of the castle. So I'm like a bit lost right now. Just thank you. Okay. <laughs> Attend history of magic. Okay, let's do that, guys. 
I, I didn't know I could. Don't think it's the delightful scent of gardenias we have. Oh boy, I'm really not at the right place. Sebastian. Dude. Okay. I forgot my today's pill. lesson, we will oh, yeah. cover a truly thrilling event. There we go. The Goblin Rebellion of 1752 and all its triumphant tragedy. But more <laughs> specifically... Oh my uh, god, the animation is so bad. The devastating effects it had on the wizard milling industry. Throughout the many goblin battles, countless wizard cloaks were lost. <laughs> Actually, we do know the number. 632. But history occurs outside the classroom. And look, it's time for my is it constitutional. One can practically osmose the history flowing through Hogwarts. I think the professor wants us to follow him. Uh. And now for a stroll to the bell tower entrance. Uh. Hall. Along with the rest of the castle, it was completed in the late early Middle Ages. At least we're out of the classroom. All in the bell towers that loom above it contain Wait. myriad. Okay, I thought Ominous artifacts. was leaving us. I am hanging out with you now. <laughs> oh, I've never been so bored in my life. <laughs> That's so accurate though, to the lore. I love it. No, come on. I wanted to stay beside him. Good Ominous. to see you again. He's my bestie. Recovered from that nasty bout of dragon pox, have we? I, uh, that wasn't me, Professor. No. I'm new here. Are you? Well, then, uh, welcome. No doubt you're eagerly anticipating my analysis of various wizarding councils, codes, statutes, and, of course, goblin rebellion. Not all goblins are rebellious. It's the Some way he venture speaks, into dude. wizarding politics, such as Irgit the Ugly. It could be interesting, but the Some way you speak, though. Some are talented artisans, such as Bragbor the Boastful. Did you say Bragbor? I know that name. Lodgok said he was an ancestor of Renrock. Hmm. Well known for his metalwork. I would imagine much of his goblin wrought iron and silver has survived to this very day. Well, where were we? Oh, oh yes. <clears throat> Back to our class topic for today. Grimbold Weft. Another notable historical figure. Uh, he's right nearby. Hmm. Oh, I can talk to him. Can you tell me where I might find Grimbold Weft? Oh, yes. Grimbold Weft. Quick with a needle and thread, that one. He's a fascinating artifact of the Goblin Rebellion of 1752. Oh, Natty is uh, out of At hospital. At any rate, room. he can be found nearby, perched in his case. Rebellion. Ominous, you wanna... Now, wanna come with me? And Look at him. I'm crushing. <laughs> no, I'm not. He's 15. I'm sorry, guys. My PC turned off again, just like it happened in the episode where we get the grab horn. I, I don't know. I need to look into that. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> It hasn't happened in such a long time. Last time I had trouble like this with my PC, it was when one of my RAM stick was faulty. So I don't know if it's the case again or if it's something else. But I don't know, it just crashes. No blue screen, just, just, just restarts. Anyways, I found uh, Grimbald Weft. That's, that's all that happened. 
And I was saying that I was not crushing on a 15 years old. That's what I was saying, basically. Yes, I rather <laughs> enjoyed seeking him out. The thrill of these scholarly pursuits. I know the feeling quite well. Now, let's turn our attention to the agreeability and general good nature of Sir Aff Buttle. He's also nearby. See what you can learn from him for your next assignment. Standing in eternal but symbolic watch over the bell tower is a retinue of loyal knights. Abandoning class to Statue wander the halls is in keeping with Professor Binz's manner of teaching. Keen-eyed students will spot the statue of Sir Afpuddle of Sir the cheerful countenance nestled among the ranks. His fame was not won by them. Jesus Christ, shut up. Oh, waving knight. The set of armor belonged to Sir Aff Puddle of the Cheerful Con Countenance, a legendary friendly knight who supposedly won, won every battle before he was fought by virtue of his amiable negotiating tactics. Some attribute his success to an overly potent, cheering charm he cast upon himself. He's so sweet! And with Rebellion. that mustache too, you can't be mean. Impossible. His warm and approachable demeanor was celebrated by old friends and newcomers alike. I encourage everyone to make the waving statue's acquaintance. Oh, this is a fat friar! Hello. Professor Binns, I found the statue of Sir Afpuddle. Ah, well done. Alas, Sir Afpuddle's affability was his undoing. Died instantly trying to befriend a basilisk. That's an idea. Eye contact is not always to be encouraged. Mm -mm. So beloved was he that even some goblins mourned his passing. Of course, that did not bode well with the rest of the goblins most of whom could not abide mourning the loss of a wizard. Pity goblins and wizards can't get along. True. But imagine how dull my lectures would be <laughs> without goblin rebellions to <laughs> Hate discuss. to break it to you, but they're already dull. History does tend to repeat. It is a series of patterns, mm -hmm. a thought both comforting and disconcerting. And that's why we have a goblin rebellion in our hands in this game. such as yourself will learn from it. That was cool. History is written by those who do their schoolwork, so they say. Or at Are least you okay, Natty? Like to say that. Having some trouble? How can we do so much and accomplish so little? Hominus has already left me. Good lord. <laughs> Alright then. I know I'm missing loads of stuff. That's just how it is. I'm gonna do them later, okay? Um, here. Let's go talk to Mrs. Weasley. I say miss sometimes, but isn't it... Is she married? I I'm not sure. Why do they say equipping better gear? Do I actually have better gear on me right now? Me don't think so. I don't. I don't know why they keep saying that. By the end of the game, game, carefully. I know how to play. Okay. <laughs> I know that I can equip better gear. Uh. Man, I wish I could do my teleport roll inside Hogwarts, but it is prohibited. Professor Weasley, you wanted to see me. I did. Dear 
We haven't had a chance to speak since... I know you were quite close with Professor Fig. Hogwarts won't be the same without him. No, it won't. But I can assure you that he would want us to press on, and that he would rest easy knowing that the future of the wizarding world is in hands like yours. Thank you, Professor. You've had quite a year. Yeah. Both inside and outside of Hogwarts. I've heard all sorts of rumors. You've ridden a Graphorn, befriended a goblin, rescued hippogriffs, even somehow ingratiated yourself with the Headless Hunt. How did you... It's harder to keep secrets around here than one might suspect. Mm. I'm just glad you found such a good friend in Miss Sweetie. Mm. It's nice to see her engaging more with her classmates. There have evidently been Snidget sightings in the area lately. If the centaurs are to be believed, two Hogwarts students are behind it. She's I'm not certain stupid. I don't know what... No need to discuss it further. What I would like to discuss is your wizard's field guide. May I see it? Of course. I'm not done, though. Oh, Lord. What do you think, Professor? I think you've been busy this year. I see some progress here, but quite a bit of your field guide. What has if yet you complete it? Fortunately, you do have some time to prepare for your OWLs. I will confess, I had a sense about you from that first moment you came bursting in late to the sorting ceremony. I am pleased to see that my instincts were correct. To think you've only been with us a year and you'll already be taking your OWLs, well, it's nothing short of astonishing. Thank you, Professor, for everything. You are most welcome. I look forward to seeing what you do during the rest of your time with us. If you complete everything before getting to her, then she must have a different dialogue, right? Oh, Lord. Dear Professor Weasley, thank you for an owl. I am overjoyed to hear that this most recent crop of 70 years includes a number of students who may be both interested and well suited for a career at the ministry. Of course, their OWLs will provide confirmation of the latter, but equally invaluable to our recruitment process is your opinion. Opinion. You have a unique perspective given your experience with us, and for that I am truly grateful. I look forward to further updates as the term progresses. Respectfully yours, Fergus Paven, Minister for Magic, London. Respectfully yours. That's a strange way to put it. But okay. Rebellion. Nice. I have never noticed that. It warms my heart to see your interest in herbology, dare I say, blossom. <laughs> okay, the house cup. All right, let's go. All right, guys. Of course, Gryffindor will win. Come on now. Is <laughs> the OWL? No, no, no. Attention! <gasps> what shall we give to um, a sick unicorn or something? The Bogart! Is it our father? No, it can't be. That's not exactly how it works, but okay. <laughs> I'm nitpicking. 
Wait, I wanted to see his fear. Aww. That's so nice. Who are you waiting for? This year we have seen our students exemplify the bravery of Godric Gryffindor. Yay! And now we can finish the loyalty uh. of Helga Hufflepuff. The wisdom of Rowena Ravenclaw. Hey! Rowena Ravenclaw. The ambition of Salazar Slytherin. Come on! The winner Ooh, of this year's wow. house cup. Excuse me, headmaster, if I may. One particular student's heroism during the attack on Hogwarts, not to mention the level to which they have excelled in their coursework as a new student, no less. Oh. Well, it would seem that it certainly merits. Oh, I'd say 100 points to their house. Wouldn't you agree? Ah, yes. Thank you, Professor Weasley. It's just because she was a Gryffindor we as well. <laughs> the hero of Hogwarts! Gryffindors than those. <laughs> no. So who won the house cup? Gryffindor or we don't know. I need to know. <gasps> it's the credits. Oh my goodness. Okay, we did it. Ah, oh, the music. I think I've talked about it like enough times I don't want to go on and on and on and on and on about it because you guys have heard it many times already but obviously I love this game it made me feel so many different emotions it was everything I've ever wanted in a Harry Potter game and more like I was not expecting the gameplay to be that good I was not expecting the open world to be so, so fun. I was not expecting Hogwarts to be so practically perfect. The castle is... I was not expecting the lore accuracy to that extent. No game is perfect. But honestly, as Harry Potter game goes, like harry potter pc 2001 and this is pretty much you know no i mean there are other harry potter games that are very good but this one i i have been waiting for this game ever since it was announced like years ago like i've been waiting i was part of like groups on on internet you know on, on forums and stuff about like news about this game and stuff like that so i've, I've been waiting for a long time i was expecting you know I was expecting it to be a disappointment because that's usually how it goes with that sort of thing and it surprised me in a positive way throughout the game it keeps on giving it brings new mechanics in a way that makes sense it it keeps you on your toes the lore at every step of the way and i'm sure there's many things that i've missed still and i can't wait to continue to play and just explore on my own and be chill about it but like i'm sure there's many things that i've missed even for a big hp nerd this is the game like this is it you want it doesn't get better than this the next game that they're gonna do because i'm pretty sure they said this this would be a franchise it won't be as good as this 
You know why? Because now we know you, you can't relive what, what you've been living for the first time with this game again. It's impossible. There is no way that the castle will get better in the second. I don't think it's possible. Maybe the story will be better. Maybe the gameplay will be better. Maybe there will be Quidditch. Sure. But the... How do I say in English? The awe. Like the absolute awe that I was, that I was in when I first started this game and even throughout the game. I've been playing for like 60 hours and I'm still in awe of everything. You can't get that again. That That's just... It doesn't get better than this, I think. It, it's just so good. Big, 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 big kudos to everybody who worked on this game. You can be so proud. You made so, so many people happy. I'm about to cry. You made so many people that we're waiting for this kind of game for such a long time. You made them so happy. And I'm one of them. But I know you guys that have been watching the playthrough, it's the same for you. I know that we all felt the same thing. We all felt like this is it. This is what we've been waiting for. This is like a dream come true. Basically, that's that's it. That's all. It's It's a dream come true for for the child in you, you know? The nostalgia is strong, like... It's just finally being able to come home to a place you've never been to. Is I have rarely felt that in a game. And I'm not saying it's the best game ever. It isn't. But it's the feeling, though. Like, I've never felt that. Ever. I don't think I've ever felt something like that in another game. And there are other games that are objectively better made. But it's 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 the feeling of... It's the lore accuracy for me. It's It, it just suits my soul. <laughs> it just does. Even though it wasn't perfect, but... Yeah. It was such a blast to get back into the HP world. I never really left, to be honest. But to really get back into it with this game... To be reminded of everything you guys and now that's my point my whole point is you guys are so amazing i hope you know this playthrough <laughs> is by far the favorite i've done on the channel by far it's not just because of the game of course the game is amazing but it's also the community that comes with this game that I... I have no words for you guys. It was amazing. You... were cheering on, you... felt like I felt, said I, I had the same reaction, can't wait to see your reaction to the next thing. I felt like I was going through this game with friends, like it was just so much fun to be in this community for this playthrough. And you guys watch the whole thing, it's crazy. I've never had so much engagement for videos. You guys watch the whole videos. You don't just watch your favorite parts like, I mean, and that's okay, you can do that. Obviously I do that too. I don't watch the whole things when I watch other playthroughs. But most of you, a lot of you, watch a lot of the video, if not everything. And that's, you have no idea. Like, that never happens. <laughs> At least for my channel. <laughs> that never happens. And you have no idea what what it means for a creator to love something they're doing. I've always loved what I'm, what I'm doing with my channel. I love literally everything about content creation. I love filming. I love playing games. I love talking about games. I love editing. I love doing thumbnails. I love doing the description in the YouTube. I love answering to comments. I love streaming. There is nothing that I don't love in what I do. But then when you have the privilege to get a community as nice as you guys, it's just the icing on a cake. So thank you, really. Like thank you to the people who made the game, but especially thank you to you guys who we're sticking with me through that playthrough. It was long. This is episode 31. Like, what? 
<laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. And we did that in like such a short amount of time. I just played, 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 played Hogwarts Legacy. I was living and breathing Hogwarts Legacy. It was having me in a chalk hold. Like, this, that's Hogwarts Legacy experience. So yeah, I'm just glad that I was able to share all of that with you. With you watching. And it doesn't matter if you don't watch everything. It doesn't matter if you never commented, you never liked a video, or you're not even subscribed. It, It's okay. You're here listening to this. You're amazing. Like, I'm, I, I don't even... <laughs> I can't express any other way. You, I'm very grateful for you guys. And the streams were so much fun too on YouTube. Yeah, it was just an amazing experience. And I will always cherish this, this playthrough. I can always go and look back when I'm feeling down. I can always go and look back on this playthrough and be like, yeah, that was nice. Like, that was fucking awesome playthrough. <laughs> that was a fucking awesome playthrough, you know? Yeah, that's that's how I feel about it. I'm making myself cry now, but... I just hope that you guys enjoyed. And... Yeah, I hope that... That you can play the game yourself if you haven't. Now that it's coming out... Uh, it's coming out tomorrow as I'm filming this. I hope that everybody that ever wanted to play this game can because it deserves to be played by not you don't even need to be a big a big fan of harry potter to begin with this is just an amazing game point blank if you're a fan though you need to play it like i please please play this game it is just it will change your life like it will change your world for at least a couple of weeks as you'll get engrossed in it like it's just one of the best games I've played only for that. Like, only because of that. I'm pretty sure this is my game of the year. We're in May now. So, who knows, but... And, and I know objectively it would never win game of the year. I don't think so. And that's fine. It's just for me, personally. And I'm biased. I know I am. I'm biased from my love for Harry Potter. I'm biased from you guys, you, the community. You're so amazing. I'm biased from my playthrough, but this is by far, I think, going to be my game of the year. It's just, it's that good for me. It has been incredible. And I hope, I hope I was able to, sh to like show that and share that and make you guys feel that, that I'm, that I really loved every second and I, I'm grateful and all of that, you know, I, I don't know. Yeah, I... Damn, this game is amazing. Even the music, like... And you know, like the animation sometimes is bad and, and the lighting is... Ew, and the ray tracing, is there really any ray tracing? Like, I know I was on performance, but like still... I saw the ray tracing and like, it's just... You know, it's not the best, and, and the gameplay can be a bit clunky at times. Not that bad, but, you know, it can be. And, and the story now, I was a little bit let down at the end there. Like, I'm not a big fan of how it ended there. Um, the house cup was fine, but, you know. But you know what? Overall, though, it is a really high quality game. Like, this is definitely going to stay in my library forever. Like, I'm never gonna delete... I can always go back to Hogwarts and chill, literally in the castle, and pretend for a while that I'm a witch and forget my own problems in life. And you know, that's 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 what games are made. That that's why that's why games are made. I mean, um, they make you forget, just for some time, you know. And the music is just—it's hard to explain. It's like there's some notes that are the same as the original Harry Potter movies but then they switch it up but it's the same vibe they did so well with the music they did so well with many things like let's be honest but yeah big kudos to everybody Avalanche look I mean what a home run and, it, and it's tough to do a game like this it, it really is, because a lot of people are expecting a lot of things. And it's huge. It's a, it's an open world. 
I don't know how they achieved it. It's very sad that the original creator is being the person that she is and shedding some shadow <laughs> on this game because of that because honestly this game did would deserve everything and like all the recognition <sighs> but look it is what it is it is what it is the original creator is fucking things up that's yeah i mean it is what it is and you know what? I'll still cherish the game for me. It, it, it will always have a place in my heart. Hogwarts has always had a place in my heart, but like Hogwarts Legacies Hogwarts <laughs> is definitely staying here. Like, yeah. Anyways, I would like to know if you've made it this far. <laughs> You're a champ. I would like to know, are you guys interested in more streams of Hogwarts Legacy or more videos but like casual, very like heavily edited side quests or something like that? Please let me know in the comments if you want more, if you want me to see, if, if you want me to see, if you want to see me um, 100% it or things like that. I could do that on stream. I could do some off camera and then the 100% on stream or something like that. Please let me know in the comments if you're interested in such content. Because if there is no interest at all, then obviously I'm just gonna do it on my own and... And I'm gonna just throw myself into Mass Effect. Because Mass Effect is the next game we're gonna play on the channel. I'm gonna take a little bit of a break after Hogwarts Legacy, maybe a week or two. And then we are jumping right in Mass Effect. I have already started playing it and I am obsessed with the world. I think it's an amazing game so far. We'll see, but I'm very excited. I can't stop playing Mass Effect. It's so good. So there's that. And then I think after that it might be second playthrough of Red Dead Redemption 2 because I don't have my first playthrough on my channel because I didn't have a channel at the time and it was over like five or six years ago I guess five years ago because it came out in 2018 it has been a while that I haven't played and I've been meaning for like over a year to play it again and I thought might as well put it on the channel so if you guys are interested in that let me know in Red Dead Redemption 2 but it would be after Mass Effect um not at the same time I think that would be a lot but yeah for for the rest of the year I'm waiting for Silk Song I don't know if it's gonna come out this year um I'm planning on playing Hades on Twitch uh before Hades 2 comes out um, I'm playing God of War Ragnarok, New Game Plus, Give Me God of War on Twitch as well. Uh, apart from that, I don't have a particular plan. We'll see what comes out. I I'm sure I'm forgetting some... I'm, I'm not gonna play Zelda. I've never played a Zelda game. I'm not gonna play Final Fantasy 16. I've never played a Final Fantasy. So these two big games are not gonna be for me for the release this year. But maybe I'm forgetting others. Um, that are gonna come out. I'm playing Jedi Survivor at the moment as well on stream on Twitch. So um, yeah, this is this is like the plan for the next couple of months on the channel. And then who knows what what the what future has in store for us? But yeah, let me know in the comments if you want to see uh, some streams again of Hogwarts Legacy because I really like doing those. They were super fun with you guys. I really enjoyed those. Thank you so much, guys. I... I'm so grateful for everybody. Seeker of knowledge. There we go. Almost level 36. And now it's like, yeah, it's just side quests. Still have a lot to do. We're only at 83%. It's not that much. 
Let me go see outside because I haven't seen spring. Let me go see that. If I go around here. It's gonna be night, I think. Yeah. Let me see. What is this tree? Illuminated like that. Oh, I think it's a beast then, isn't it? Yeah. Of Jovernals. That's so cute with the lanterns. Oh lord. Look at that. I mean, the child in me is still like... So impressed. How beautiful. Yep. <laughs> Game of the year for me, for sure. There's no way. Nothing beats this. For this year. Impossible. I hope there's no students. Mm, we're good. Slow down now. There we go. <sighs> I'm sad to end it here, guys. I, I, I really am. It's tough. It, it it really is tough to give up. To, to I mean, not give up, but to finish this playthrough. It, it is very bittersweet. And more bitter than sweet, I would say. <laughs> you know? But... All good things must end. All bad things end as well, you know? That's how it is in life, and... We're on to, on to the next best thing. That's how it is. And this was an amazing experience. And I can't thank you guys enough for everything. Literally. Thank you so much. Especially for those of you that stayed the whole playthrough. Like, that's amazing. Thank you for the comments, the likes, the subscriptions. The channel grew so much thanks to Hogwarts Legacy. It, like, the, it's just... I'm really grateful, really grateful. Even if, even if I didn't have any growth, this game, I mean, it wouldn't have impaired my experience at all. That's a given. But it's just so nice when you are able to tap into a community that feels like home to you. I can't even explain what you guys have brought me during this playthrough. Being able to reach so many of you and to be able to feel the same things and relate on a deep level with this game is priceless to me that's that is why i made my channel to begin with two years ago i made my channel because i wanted to relate and to connect with other like-minded people who love the same game that i do and never feel alone again when it's hard you know that was the case for me for the last of us part two i was alone when i played that game and i never want to feel that again <laughs> ever i needed to talk about it to someone and having a community that can validate how you feel or tell you that it's bullshit whatever but like you know having a community you can talk to about games and connect and feel together is just my main goal with this channel and it was reached definitely reached and beyond with this playthrough so that's that's why it's my favorite for sure not that it wasn't the case for previous playthroughs but this one is just will always have a place in my heart always 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 so thank you so much for everything i will shut up now mischief managed and i'll see you guys in the next video which shall be mass effect i think so you can look forward to that but hope you enjoyed today's and yeah i'll see you in the next video
バイバイ